right, fuzz the pie guy here. I'm going to show you how to change the uh, pie username to something different because that's definitely highly recommended to do so, but a lot of people don't. I'm one of those at times. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and change the pie user to whatever you want to change it to. So the first thing we need to do is add the user. So I'll throw a link in the description to my website for this information. So right now we need to make a username up. So we're just going to, uh, we'll just call it summer since we're in summer. And now it's going to ask for the uh, password of the current user. So now it's going to ask for the password of the new user. And we'll just verify that. And we could just hit enter and bypass all this stuff. Then we'll just say yes. Type in Y for yes. Clear that. And now we are going to add our new user to the groups. And I'm not going to type all this in, but there it is. But now we need to replace that guy with our new user. So we'll just type summer here at the end. All right. So now that that's all added in there. We are going to do the following now. And we'll type in our new user. Clear that. <clears throat> so now we'll do a p kill command on our Our user, which is normally would be pi, but since mine is, uh, well, it was test before, so we'll just do that. So now we'll type in our password, and it's going to disconnect you. So we're just going to restart our session here and log in with the new username. Let me clear my thing here. All right, so now, since that is done, we are going to delete the Pi user because if we do a CD home, we have our new username and our old username, which is if this is a fresh install, that would say pi and not test. So we want to delete the username. So we'll do a sudo delete user. And since mine is test, I'm going to put test in here. Then the password. All right. So now that that's done. And... We still have our directory. It should still be under here. So we are going to CD back out of that. And we want to delete the uh, directory also. Now you don't have to do this. But if you want to, we can delete our directory here. So I'll put test in. All right. So that's done. So now, if we do a CD home, <clears throat> our test slash pi uh, home directory is now no longer there. So now when you log into your pi, you're going to log into whatever you made your username to be. So now, if we try to log in as pi all right so you're still able to log in as your pi user so let's go ahead and lock that
All right, so now let's try it. And there we go. So now we can't log in as Pi and let me do another one and we're going to do a test since uh, we logged in as test and that one is not working which we kind of figured that because uh, that's what we went ahead and changed but to also turn off the pi user you need to do the uh, password lock so like i said i'll throw a link in the description for this information to my website so thanks for watching stay tuned for another one